birds equal to the cost of the birds. If the cost of 20 sparrows 1 rupee, 1 pigeon 5 rupees, and if the cost of 1 parrot is 1 rupee, then how can you buy 100 birds in 100 rupees? shows the number of birds. Sparrows plus pigeons plus parrot is equal to 100. S plus P plus R equal to 100. Eliminate P by subtracting the second equation from the first equation. Subtract the like term S minus S120. P minus P get cancelled. R minus 5R, then 100 minus 100, 0. S minus S by 20, find the LCM, 20S minus S by 20, which is 19S by 20. Then R minus 5R is minus 4R. Move the 4R to the right side. 19 is divided by 20 equal to 4 hours. R becomes 19 by 80 years. Put S value as the same divisor 80 or the multiples of 80 so that it gets cancelled and we can find R. Let's put S equal to 80. So here this 80 and 80 get cancelled and R is 19. When S is 80, R is 19. Substitute this S value and the R value in the equation 1 to find P. S plus P plus R is 100. Hence, P becomes 1. animals and the cost of animals. 80 sparrows rupees 4, 1 pigeon rupees 1, 19 parrots rupees 95. So the number of animals and the cost of animals both equals 100. Let's solve one more question of the same type. Cost of the items equal to the number of items. Cost of 1 pen 5 rupees, 16 eraser 1 rupee and 1 pencil 1 rupee, then how can I get 100 items for 100 rupees? First equation, number of pens P plus number of erasers E plus number of pencils N 
equal to 100. Second equation, cost of pens, cost of one pen into the number of pens. So, phi into P plus cost of eraser, cost of one eraser into the number of eraser. 1 by 16 into E plus cost of pencils, cost of one pencil into N. So, 1 into N. 5P plus 1 by 16E plus 1N equal to 100. Take the first and the second equation, subtract it, so change the sign and here n plus n minus n get cancelled. Next p minus 5p, so it 1 minus 5p, then plus the erasers, so 1 minus 1 by 16 eraser. equal to 100 minus 100 a constant 0 1 minus 5 minus 4p and plus 1 minus 1 by 16 take lcm 16 it's here 16 16 minus 1 15 divided by 16 1 minus 1 by 16 take lcm 16 minus 1 divided by 16 so 15 by 16 the eraser equal to 0 Keep the eraser count 15 by 16 and move the pen minus 4p to the right. So it becomes plus 4p. Keep the variable p and move 4 to the left. So it comes in the denominator. So 15 divided by already 16 is there. 16 into 4. 16 into 4 in the denominator. So 16 into 4 is 64. So 15 divided by 64 erasers is equal to pen. Now put the E value as 64. Put the E value as 64. So 15 divided by 64 into 64 it's 15 64 and 64 will get cancelled so it's 15 when the eraser is 64 the pen is 15 Substitute P equal to 15 and E equal to 64 in equation 1. P plus E plus N is equal to 100. N equal to 100 minus 79. So number of pencil N equal to 21. items and the cost of items 15 pens 75 rupees 64 erasers 4 rupees 21 pencils 21 rupees so the number of items and the cost of items both equals 100